Hey everyone, someone here from Win Strength. On today's quick training tip video, I wanted to talk about chalk. We're getting through some deadlifts today, um, and I just wanted to give a quick rundown on how I like to use chalk. Um, I found that this is probably the best way to do it, uh, especially for deadlifts or anything where you're obviously gripping a barbell. Um, you don't want to put too much chalk at the end of the day, that's really the message, the take home, if you will. Uh, you don't need to be sitting there just like putting half of this block on your hands um, like that in the focus that's probably a bit too much chalk I would say um, but if you do put that much chalk on what you can do is uh, just rub it between your hands and you really just want a nice light coating between your hands just like that see that so that's you don't really want too much because when you put too much um, it starts to act almost like a lubricant because you're getting an extra layer of dirt, as it were, in between your hands and the barbell. Now uh, the second point I like to do is make sure that you get this webbing here between the uh, thumb and the index, because that's really where you're going to be gripping a lot of that around. So um, if you're able to get some extra chalk in there, it'll just help a little bit with that grip. Uh, you don't really need it here on the pinky, because I mean, for me personally, my pinky isn't really playing that big of a role. I'm going to bring the barbell, it's mainly the first, it's mainly these three and the pinky's just there for support. Um, but again, you really want to focus on this part of the hand down because this is where the grip's going to be the main point of it. This meaty part of the palm's really unnecessary for the most part because you're not really gripping it with that part of the hand. Uh, when you look at how you grip a barbell, whether that be double overhand, underhand, however that case may be. Um, the, the meaty part of the pump isn't really getting in contact with the barbell. So hopefully uh, that helps with your gym. Uh, if your gym doesn't allow chalk, find a new gym, or use some liquid chalk, which is just chalk with some alcohol added to it, you spray that on your hands, uh, less mess, and your gym won't know using chalk. So there you go. This has been Selma from Wind Strength, and remember, better life through strength.